What's going on, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Junkyard Breaks. Uh, this is another pull box video. Um, these are all the comics that I'm getting uh, this week, and we'll start with my two favorites. These are my two highlights of the week. So, May's book, number one. I like this book. I'm, I'm looking forward to this one. Um, and Last Flight Out, number one. This is also a book that I'm really into. I can't wait to read this one. So these two books are my picks this week. Um, so you, The Me You Love in the Dark, number two. I gotta read this. Star Wars Adventures. This is Boba Fett's first time in this book. Uh, Empire Strikes Back. This is the John Tyler Christopher versions with the action figure. So IG-88. Uh, Peach Momoko's Kazar, Lord of the Savage Land. The Shepherd. I'm always buying these Black Caravan Scout Comics books. Love the art. Um, Dancing with the Dragon, number one. Another Scout Comic book. Uh, this is a cool uh, Swamp Thing book. That's really badass. Swamp Thing, number seven. Uh, the Unbelievable Unteens, number two. Uh, this is The Many Deaths of Lila Star, number five. The Foil foil Variant. Uh, this is Dead Box, number one, from Vault. Toxin, number one. Another nice one. And, of course, the Scotty Young version. The last book you'll ever read. Not All Robots, number two. Masters of the Universe Revelation, number three. Um, not a fan of the animated show, but um, I don't know. We'll see. I love, love He-Man. So. Uh, Eve, number five. Another one I love these covers. I've been grabbing these. This is probably uh, one I'll read when the trade comes out. Uh, Search for Who, number one from Aftershock. Very cool art. Like this. Cool interior, too. Uh, Dr. Afra, number 14. Cool cover. Army of Darkness, 79 from Dynamite, number one. I just felt something on the back. Is that. What is that? I don't know what that is, but. It looks like an pop it off. I don't know. That's weird. Anyway. Amazing Spider-Man 73. Still Sinister War. Nice House on the Lake. Number 4. Everybody's saying this is a good read, so I will uh, probably wait for the trade to come out, which will be soon. Very cool. Alright, that was quick. Now my pick of the week. As you all know, every time I do a comic book pull list, I am doing uh, a pick of the week. This week I'm picking Dragon's Lair number one. Uh, first appearance of Dirk the Daring in comics. Um, I forgot the princess's name. Daphne, I think? Something like that. Um, but anyway, uh, Ryan Reynolds is going to be Dirk the Daring in a live action version of Dragon's Lair. Maybe. I, I think it's pretty locked down, but. Um, this uh, book came out, I think um, I think it came out in the 90s. It was a miniseries book of four. Um, a, not a really big print run, and a lot of them are damaged. Every time I try to buy one online, they're, they're just damaged. So uh, probably a, ha a hard one to get in high grade. Nine eights do go for like $1,000. But uh, you can still get um, very fines in the 99 to 125 dollar range um, that's where I got mine um, I'm not getting the near mint on slab stuff either they want too much money but Dragon's Lair number one is a cool little book that uh, not a lot of people are specking on right now and that is my recommendation this week so like and subscribe comment down below uh, do all the good stuff and uh, I'll see you again next time